say. Miss Patrick. Hello. Each coffee needs to be treated individually. Um, each coffee has um, profiles that are within the green coffee that as a roaster it's our job to find out and figure out the best way to approach enhancing those flavors, bringing those flavors out. So for us, we usually roast a coffee three to four times before we start production roasting it to understand how that coffee wants to be dated, if you want to put it in that term. Because it has everyone has a different personality, so just treat it as an individual. Okay. A lot of coffee roasters put art before science, and if you don't understand the science of what's happening and how to manage um, chemical reactions that are taking place in roasting, um, you're not roasting, the roaster's doing the, the work, and you're just kind of following along. But we take a lot of precautions and a lot of um, pride in the way we roast. But we do, we have one of 30, 31 certified coffee labs in the world and our lab is full of analytical equipment so we can analyze the coffee before we roast it so we know what we're doing, how we're going to treat the coffee. We test it for density, moisture, water activity, we'll read it in a color reading device to check our consistency and then we'll cup it and report on it. We do things that are quite a bit different than most people. Um, we actually understand the science, the science behind it, so I think that one, that's one of the reasons that sets us apart. Plus, um, my background in wine, I have um, a very advanced palate. I'm a Q grader, and I can understand how best to make blends and how best to create the coffees. So we're just different. That's all.